An anonymous number claims my fiancé, 29F, has been cheating on me, 31M. My GF and I have been together for 8 months and we have just got engaged, 2 weeks ago. We met a long time ago in college while we were in med school I am now a doctor but she didn't make it pass med school year 1 and now teaches general science for some 4th graders. She is the love of my life and she has given me zero reason to not trust her. Her and I got engaged like I said 2 weeks ago and yesterday I got a text saying, my n word I wouldn't marry that b word. Now I laughed it off as I thought he was describing a black person and had the wrong number as I'm white, Asian. I responded with, wrong number, and he named my fiancé by name and said that she was sleeping with him on and off for the past six months, 0.75% of our relationship. I tried calling but he used one of those fake text now numbers so I can't even track him. I asked him to tell me something about my fiancé only someone who has seen her naked would know and he told me about a birthmark that was right near her thigh. Of course if she was at a club wearing a super mini skirt, which she doesn't wear, nor does she go to clubs, then he could tell the birthmark. I kept asking for more details he gave a couple, where she works, what time she gets off work enough to make me start worrying. And he just said, my conscience is clear good luck. I freaked out and showed these to my fiancé she said she didn't know who that was and started crying. And claimed it was likely an ex and says she has never cheated on me ever. But like why would an ex have my number and the only exes she has don't live in our city. This guy claims they have been screwing each other frequently. I have no idea how to trace this number my fiancé keeps saying she doesn't know who this is. Please help. Looked through her phone after I asked her. Didn't see anything. Ask for screenshots from the random number for proof. It's long shot but it's worth a try. Info. Op. Did you check the phone immediately during the first conversation or later? Okay. So this person obviously knows her and knows of you. You're recently engaged. That could trigger a jealous ex and would explain all the personal knowledge he has of her. Did you two announce it on social media? Has she been at her job? Same school. Same hours. Since she was with her last boyfriend. S. Just wondering if this is new information that only someone currently in her life would know. If it's been the same for years or if it's discoverable. Like on LinkedIn or Facebook. Thinking back. Can you remember any large gaps in time when she wasn't home? Took longer to get home than she should have? Any clinging to her phone? How long after showing her the texts did you wait before searching her phone? Was she ever alone with it? Any pictures of her in shorts or a bikini online that could explain knowledge of the birthmark? I am suspicious of your girlfriend. But I also think the timing of this is consistent with someone who's trying to ruin your relationship. You realize it could be a woman, right? A former friend or frenemy trying to stir shit up. But like why would an ex have my number? But why would a guy she's screwing have your number? If she's never given you reason to mistrust her. And her phone is clear. And you've known her whereabouts the past 8 months. Have you? I mean. Everybody's been in lockdown and there haven't been in-person classes until just this fall. If you're in the US. Then use reason and figure it's a troublemaker. This may help you HTTPS spy4.me slash text now dash number dash lookup slash there is always an ip address whatever app you use dash ask her who was the latest x that would know about her work schedule how would anyone know that unless she told them honestly it's not hard to find info on people if you know how to operate a search engine 
I was able to find this chick's address. Parents' names, phone numbers, etc. all simply from her online handle. If you have an online presence, the information is out there. On the cheating part, that's your call. But it could be just some malicious asshole or past boyfriend trying to fuck with her. Or it could even be someone you know who likes you trying to fuck with you so you won't get married. People are fucked. I'd ignore it unless there's more information. I think your girlfriend has a stalker. Creepy AF. There's simply no smoking gun here. Someone is able to provide enough information to manipulate you into thinking there is. However, what is their motivation? Why are they unwilling to identify themselves? That alone says they only have malicious intent. So it's message them and say if they are too cowardly to reveal themselves then you know they are. Just a jealous ex or supposed friend out to cause trouble. Even the fact they can say where she works and shift is basic knowledge and is nothing compared to. Giving an example of when she might have spent time with someone. Might even be an ex of yours. Well fuck, now op got suspended. Just to share my own weird experience. About a year after getting married. Some random person started messaging my now ex unrelated husband talking about how I was cheating with them and a few others or something. No idea who the person was. And I'd never cheated or even flirted with anyone else. Or anything that could have been misconstrued as inappropriate. Some people just love chaos. Look a birthmark on your thigh as information a lot of people could have including not only everyone you ever slept with but probably half the women you've been shopping with who've seen you try anything on the fact that this person won't talk to you but only text through an anonymous number means it doesn't even have to be a guy stirring shit it could be a jealous friend i feel like a guy might talk to you if asked but a woman never could because she would immediately give herself away edit Fixed word. Sue putting on my tinfoil hat but perhaps it's someone who is actually after, knows op. Before living with my college roommate, I wouldn't think people would be this crazy but my roommate stalked her ex's fiancé, male ex, female fiancé, and pulled very similar shit. Literally camped outside her work. Stalked her social media back years etc. and tried to break them up like this. It would explain why the anonymous person had OP's phone number. Op. Does your GF have any old pics of her in a swimsuit or something on FB, Insta, etc.? Do her parents have childhood pics of her? Because my roommate was e-stalking this poor girl's parents FB as well. Boomers who did not understand privacy settings apparently. Op. Can you think of anyone in your life who might want to break you two up for whatever reason? As an aside, after my roommate drunkenly bragged about this to me, I told a dude I kinda knew in her friend group. They got it sorted thankfully because this insane shit apparently wasn't out of character for her. Yeah. I would probably trust my partner in this scenario to be honest there's no literal evidence that it happened. It could be a really mean ex or person. Or it could be true. It's not hard to get someone's number so that's whatever. Sit your girl down. Tell her you want to be with her. But she has one last chance to be absolutely honestly. Either way. Then you have to simply choose whether to trust her and take it as the truth or not. Balls really in court unfortunately. I would hold off on the marriage, engagement for now. She might not keep any messages, text on that phone. Does she have another phone? Do you guys live together? Does her exes have your number? It's disconcerting that this person knows her schedule and your number and her birthmark. My best advice is if your fiancé has given zero cheating vibes and you checked her phone. 
immediately without finding anything then I would give her the benefit of the doubt. Not some anonymous jerk hiding behind a screen with zero proof. Screenshots. Pics. Etc. If they were truly trying to be honest, they would answer all your questions and calls. Emo. This sounds like a jealous woman. Either your ex. A woman that wants to be with you. IEFWB, ONS. Or someone who has it out for your fiancé. A jealous friend maybe? Why else would they not answer the phone? A man truly looking out for you would provide anything you ask. Not drop a bomb and run. That's classic manipulative female energy. Good luck. First off. Why would you marry someone after only? What I'm assuming. Is 9 months? That's your first problem. Secondly. You say she doesn't wear mini skirts or go clubbing. Yet you think this is somehow a way that dude seen the birthmark? You are actively ignoring red flags including but not limited to her crying as soon as you show her the texts that's at the very least suspect do not marry her whether it's her ex or she cheated it's too many red flags and too little time otherwise good luck could it be a parent of hers i've seen this shit from mother-in-laws I'm putting the blame on some hyper-jealous co-worker, schoolmate or something like that. It's easy to be friends with someone on social media and find out a lot about them without even talking. Especially since these days everyone doesn't realize how much they're revealing when they consistently post their fav bar, their selfies, their pets and the like. It's not hard to do a little digging and find what you need. Also why I highly recommend being careful what you post online. That stuff stays with you for life. But this is just the only thing I could think of where no one is at fault. Just that crazy rondo number. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.